What is going on, guys? Today I'm gonna go pick up again my friend Hookah, but I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about him. Because he reminds me so much of myself when I was younger, even though he's incredibly successful in his own respect, like I am still not there yet, but he's killing it. And he reminds me so much of a younger version of myself, which brings me to my next point, because before I go pick him up and get in the 720 and do like, 7.30, yes, I'm sorry, and do the whole shebang. I wanna to explain to you guys because a few of you keep obsessing about your life and about how is it going and what do you wanna do with it. I just wanna say, even though you guys can look up all the shit that I do, all my businesses and all that stuff online, it's not that I know who I am yet. That is the biggest thing in life. Finding out who you are, what you're good at, that is the great part of the journey and this is why I have one of these so I can show you real quick, guys. So, no matter what your end goal in life is, no matter what it is, it could be having a ranch full of animals and let's say that's gonna be that and that's gonna be your goal and you're standing right here don't ever think you're just gonna get there in a straight line by just buying a ranch and getting animals and putting them in there that only happens in movies guys that doesn't happen in real life in real life the trajectory that we all follow to get to that point is kind of like this all right I'm gonna go this way no it didn't work that way no actually this way nope I'm actually gonna go here nope I'm actually gonna go to here nope here here and at some point in your life you're bound to hit this and also at that point that's not the end of your life you just got to the finish line which is the starting line for the next one it's not about who you you are today it's about what you want to become in that journey for you so I want you guys to think about that not stress so much about like what am I gonna do if I don't go and pick the right career in school in college whatever it is it's all part of the adventure you can get in a car and drive for an hour to see your wife and be miserable the whole time because you're thinking god what is she gonna tell me she's cheating on me or you can drive for an hour to see your wife gather flowers you got in the car you start playing the best song so you can get in the best mood possible drive by the coast and add like even 30 minutes more to your drive because once you get to your destination you're gonna be so fucking happy you got there that's what I want to leave you guys with let's go have some fun with cars any day I can find a good excuse to drive this, I'm gonna do it, people. This is one of those cars that just makes me so happy and I truly think it's the best car in the world. McLaren 730S, named like that by your boy because I, I still love that and I'm obsessed with it. Oh, God. All right, let's, let's do this, people. Please have gas. No! Now I'm picking hookah in the corner of Vine and Sunset. I'm on Vine, Sunset's crossing right here, and the question's gonna be, on what side of the corner is he gonna be? Which, I should've thought about that just right before texting him. God damn it. Actually, we nailed it. Let me get this dude in here. Also, I don't know how to unlock the car. Oh, you just unlock it right there. <laughs> Everyone forgets what the door thing is. And one thing you're gonna have to get used to with me, my dude, is What's gonna that? be a, si a rather simple thing. I'm always running out of gas. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm I mean, sorry. I never, I, I always make sure I have like full gas. Do you really? Yeah, the car drives better. You have no worries. All right, I, I see guys, I gotta learn from my boy. That's the only responsible thing I do, I, I think. Hey, you're still way more responsible than I am then. Good for you. <laughs> Good for kudos, you. Kudos for me. <laughs> kudos to you. <laughs> You, that is from completely empty you guys see only 13 gallons literally I thought I was not gonna make it anywhere else so these tanks on these cars are getting smaller and smaller but the fuel efficiency is getting better and better so it's a give or take you you don't feel like it's worse but it is a little bit inconvenient just a tiny little bit on the Chiron though that's got to be fucked up I'm gonna steal one from your playbook and I'm gonna take this handheld cuz uh, I'm always like filming somewhere with the thing everyone's know, looking and it's embarrassing these are good things about these cameras you can just like slide in put them inside thank you so much how are you sorry I'm gonna be I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a dick and just walk inside have you been here before Damn, you dude. tell me. Damn, dude. Hey, Farsha needs to learn a couple of, uh, uh, let approaches. me hit on you. Yeah, you know, approaches. Approaching is approaches. the key. What is your key to approaching? Confidence me? and always a touch of comedy and Latin flavor. You've got that. Farsha, no, he can learn though. But, but Farsha's got the Persian flavor. That's, that's. So he, you know, it's still brown rice. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. We're done with the nice little break that we took, even though we don't know what the fuck we're taking the break for. Which good is always coffee. Interesting. Good coffee's always a good excuse good for anything. Break. I think we're going to do some passes with the car. We're we're gonna do some flyby so that we can get like the nice nice from the outside yes for his channel though you guys know that when I'm filming there's no nice nice <laughs> and it's only like a very shaky view of everything <laughs> I'm sorry guys. No, it's a nice nice it's a shaky of, of something nice it's it's a shaky of something 
Yeah. <laughs> it is, it is. And also, it's nice to be back on Rodeo Drive. You don't get to see it all the time now that I live uh, so far away from the city, but. Oh, yes. Look at those ladies. Hey, mommy. Oh, yeah, that, and that's why we bring him over here so that he can just. Uh, ¿Qué pasa, mami? Yeah? Un rato de diversión, eh? <laughs> that's what I, I'm, I'm trying to figure how to get Hookah to show Farshad how to do that. So, that's a nice video by itself. I know. I <laughs> I know. I wish I would have brought Farshad just on that on that alone. Farshad. <gasps> Dude, Santa Claus is driving that car. Do you see him? <laughs> do you see him? It's, it's got like a and pine he's got and a Christmas stuff. tree yeah. on the back, too. Holy <laughs> shit. So he's getting out of the car so he can do his yes. fly by shot. And that's commitment right there, because I don't do that shit. It's just porn. Boom. Just porn. Boom. That is absolute car porn. So I'm, I'm hoping that I can steal some from his channel, guys. That's gonna be our day with Hookah. I'm gonna drop him off right now. Everything that starts great has a great ending too. Yes, so except this, sex sometimes. It, for It's always sad in my case. Yeah. Don't be, I understand, I understand. <laughs> it starts lame and it doesn't finish. I'm just kidding. Oh, wow. It's been a pleasure, dude. Thank you so much for your time. It's been so much fun. It's Bro, been real. This guy's mind is fucking insane. You guys gotta check out Hookah. Even if you don't speak Spanish, his shit is other level. You will never <laughs> understand how epic it is. Also, on another note, we'll be doing some epic shit tomorrow. Tomorrow, that right? is true. So with the dude, have a great fucking day, dude. Thank you for coming. All right, Woo! boys. And part two of this vlog, because today we're actually putting the work in. We're shooting a show, kind of like within the veins of Banging Gears that we were doing a couple years ago, but we're doing it in Spanish right now with the fucking Papi Hookah, because why not? I, I don't think I've ever seen <laughs> this motherfucker. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a car show in Spanish. Have you seen a big car show in Spanish? Negative. That's but why we're about we're, to create one. That's why we're fucking doing it, baby. Ah! So part of the activity is obviously let him pick whatever cars he wants to learn about. Uh, we're gonna take these three because this is the easiest combo and that's the one that's been in every single magazine fighting for, let's see who's the fastest, the most comfortable one, or the greatest car of all time. So I got my Pedro, I got my Ivan, I got my Pargini. They're all gonna be supporting the team and let's fucking get it rolling, people. There you go. Utilizing the car properly while Pedro gets a nice spot. Fargini's right here. The Lambo's right there. O'Gara's right there. This we're gonna be setting up base camp so that we can grab the cars and just go up the canyons real quick. How was that drive, Fargini? Uh, look, it's an amazing car. It's very easy to drive, but it's very stressful driving your car. <laughs> you just don't wanna, Good. Don't wanna mess it up. I, I appreciate it. Can I make it. two comments? Yeah. I can't believe this car at like 70, 80, you hit, you know when you like gunned it? At like 80, 90, it pushes. It feels like it you're actually, going from zero to 60. Yeah, it actually is pushing you like for the first time. Yeah. Secondly, when we were braking over mm -hmm. there, the 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 wing like oh it's yeah like so it's the many best things happening at yeah, the same time it's the best hey how was the AMG GTR fucking beast I mean the sound it makes oh oh and like, the rumble right the, rumble. the power behind yes, it yes yes you feel it like instantly I honestly I took the traction control off in a little turn and it wants to have fun oh yeah it does it's oh fun. it's a lot of power to the rear wheels oh yes fuck yeah. Whenever you're ready, <laughs> buddy. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right. Crying out for attention. <laughs> you whore. I can't go into anything without showing people the greatest car ever made, the Rolls Royce Phantom. Everyone thinks people pay me to say things like this. Is this so delicious or what? Okay. It is delicious. Is actually a great word to describe it. The finishes. Uh, there is a finish in English. Yeah, the, the finishes. finishes. Yeah. On point. On point. Everywhere. It looks like on top of the gloss, an angel just like. 
lift it and all over. That's the finish. You're right. Look, I mean, I, you were just showing me the reflection here of the starlight. It's insanely smooth. Yeah. That's that's what uh, six hundred thousand dollars will get uh, you. Yeah. Do you have six hundred thousand dollars you can loan me? Not not with me you right now. You son of a bitch. Yeah. Parker, what a surprise to see you here. You came here to O'Gare just to take all of our cars. But... I, I did. I, I actually called them ahead of time and was like, which one is uh, the Alejandro gang? <laughs> I was like, okay, we'll do that one. To avoid any of those come, he's like, oh, Alejandro reviewed that, Parker already reviewed that, so that everyone can get the shit. I got the GT3 RS and I, well, you already owned one, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't need to borrow one, damn it. Once you have a car like that, everyone always complains, why don't you use it the way you're supposed to? So we're making sure that hookah gets to use it the proper way that it's intended to be used. So we have this massive space, which we should not be here right now. I am completely aware of it. So uh, uh, right after we're done here, we're just gonna bounce out of here. So let's do some donuts. <laughs>
Ooh. I have good news and bad news. Opa. What's the bad? Found this. I don't know if it's from your car, so let me look to see if it's from your car. Oh, it doesn't let me see. Okay. It doesn't look like it's. De que parte sería? No es, no es un ring. Let me go look. Hold on. Oh. No! Yes. No! 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 Oh. Hey, how amazing that I, I, I even found it. How the fuck did you find it? I know, I have no idea. How funny is that? Well, we need a new one now. Wait, you're gonna have to charge yourself $12,000. I'm so sorry! <laughs> you fucking scumbag! So we came over here to the canyons. Obviously, we had to do some drone shots. We had to do some epic passes, flybys. Of course, we're ready. And now, Buddy is gonna be taking all of the B-roll while Hookah does his thing Espérate. behind the wheel. There's a stone over. La piedrota, way. There's a massive stone the not size that, of. Not that massive, but like for this right side, this is massive. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I have a massive dick. For this right, for, for this, this right, <laughs> for for any other normal looking ones, it's just not. It's just a dick. It's just average. <laughs> Ooh. Wait, the sound changes drastically. Yeah, on each mode. Ooh. Yeah. So the street sounds amazing as well. Yeah, of course. To everyone at Galping that told me we were never gonna use this properly as a camera car, etc. There we go. That's Pedro being fucking brave as shit. You need locations and ideas for filming every day? This, is, this has been my plan the whole time. Before I get rear-ended. You, you know you wanna get rear-ended. Hey, Kuka, this is what we do here in the U.S. All YouTubers do the same thing. <laughs> All of us do the same damn thing. Parker, I'm sorry. I just I just can't believe that I saw you right now. This is just ridiculous. And we're doing the same thing. I, hey, that, this is what, hey, this is what being a YouTuber in the U.S. means. It is, it is. I guarantee you we're not doing the same thing. <laughs> Have fun, dude. Drive safe. You, Parker. Get it. Get it, get it. I think to finish our day yes, sir. with the sun coming down and everything that's happening and that being the last car, we should just go to Malibu and go have lunch there. A romantic lunch. Have a romantic lunch there. What do you think? It'll be five o'clock. What kind of lunch is this? Well, this is my breakfast too, by the way. <laughs> is it really? Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. Do Are you down? Let's go. Bargini, thank you. Oh, is there an Ivan back there? Man, let's do it. Let's get that early bird special. Fuck yeah, we're gonna feel like we're 65. <laughs>
and good people, good cars, good work, good food in a great place by the ocean, baby. The good stuff. California. Miren cómo le cuesta atrás. Está altísimo el cabrón. Yo no fit in this. How do you say that? Yo no quepo. Wow, look at all these buttons. Look at all these buttons for your seats. Yeah. I can't tell which one's. I can't tell which one's body. Follow your heart, Fargini. 